I decided on another practice vlog because I did not expect so many of you guys to enjoy my last one and for so many of you guys to also come to my channel for the first time from that vlog so welcome and thank you for watching I hope you could hear some difference between the beginning and the end I yeah was just trying to make myself sound less awkward because I can be quite awkward sometimes actually a, a lot of the times when I'm practicing and trying to work through music I can sound constipated and awkward so I hope you heard some improvement I am going to answer a question from my last vlog but before I go do that I just finished the interview and my gosh, I am so grateful for your support and also for them because it was such an honor to be interviewed by that person. I will say who it is <laughs> once it gets published and once I'm allowed to say anything about it, but ah, so happy and grateful. Anyway, so back to the question and answer. I picked Aegis, 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 I don't know how to say your name. Flasos, uh, you asked, why don't you play more modern composers? It's a valid question, and I do get asked a lot about whether I play any other genres or play more contemporary stuff. So the thing is, I am very passionate about classical music, and I really believe in doing what I love and really for anyone to follow their passion. So classical music is definitely my main thing. But that's not to say that I never play anything contemporary. If it happens that I encounter a piece of music that I like, then I will show it to you guys and I will play it. But here comes my food analogy. If you think of your favorite restaurant, do they serve, let's say, really good steak and really good Chinese food at the same time? Probably not. So it's kind of like that. Like I really want to play classical music and really show the beauty of it to my very best ability. So classical music is going to be my main focus. That's not to say that I won't play anything else outside of the canon, but there's also just so much, especially for piano in the classical repertoire era, that I will never run out of things to play. And yeah, all right, that's it. Thank you so much for your question and thanks for watching all the way through here. If you guys have more questions, please leave them down in the comments. And in my next vlog, I will pick one from this one to answer. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe if you're new and I hope you have been motivated to keep striving at whatever you're doing. And I hope you found this vlog as enjoyable as you did of my last one. Thank you so much. See ya.